It's Jim Testa. Go right, Jim! Hello, everybody. I am uh, Jim Testa from New Jersey, or as I'm known at Club Helsinki, that guy who knows Foggy on this. Aha, uh -huh, that guy. Uh, this is my, in case you're having deja vu, no, you're not. This is my third visit here. Excellent. Uh, every time I've come up to visit Foggy, we go way, way back. Uh, when before he moved to Hudson, Foggy lived in New Jersey with you know, I've me. I've heard that. We played uh, many shows, much like this, which means that we didn't get paid back then either. Yeah, well. <laughs> but, uh, you know, in fact, we're such old friends that when we first met, he was mildly hazy Otis. And only became foggy. Hazy? Oh, back in the hazy business. Yeah. I see. Now, how's that sound to you, uh, Jim? Does that sound okay in the monitors? You got everything you need? That's fine. And how about the vocal? Vocal blur? Yeah, that's, oh, I'm, that's terrific. Excellent, all right. Okay, so I am, I am part of that nearly extinct species known as the political protest folk singer. All right. Like, always nice to... Welcome back. <laughs> always nice to lift something from the headlines. So uh, today we're going to dedicate a song to the Reverend Joel Osteen. Oh, God bless him. Hopefully you watched a little CNN this morning and know what I'm Reverend Joel, about. I didn't. I like to be a Christian. You know I wouldn't hesitate. If not for all those homilies of intolerance and Cause when I hear the word Christian, well, the first thing that comes to mind is how we're all gonna get to heaven, not who we're gonna leave behind. Jesus roamed the promised land with a dozen other guys. If two of them got busy, do you really think he'd mind? And scripture tells us all about Mary Magdalene. Read between the lines, nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Good for him. us all and then they tell us who the hell communists and homosexuals and anyone who masturbates and all us liberals will get shown the door when we reach the pearly gates that's what they say now those televangelists taking money from the poor they get so rich and fat and if what would Jesus do? Well, I don't think he'd do that. Because Jesus said to love thy neighbor and cast no stones if you have sinned. Nowhere in the good book does it say you got to vote Republican. Yeah, that's right. I like to be a Christian. I wouldn't hesitate. If not for all those homilies and intolerance and hate. 